It's time to talk health now and how to get help as we age. In the years before and after menopause, hormone levels can go up, they can go down all over the place, but hormone replacement therapy can help. And Jennifer Icavelli from Mom Doc Women for Women is here with more. She's going to help us out today. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks for having me. Um, we've heard a lot about hormone replacement therapy. How mm -hmm. does it work right now? Well, I like to think of it more as hormone restoration combined with balancing hormones amongst each other. So women have optimal youthful hormone levels and our goal is to restore hormones to those levels. Our goal is then to combine and balance these with other hormones like thyroid hormone, adrenal hormones, DHEA, cortisol. Who is someone who needs this type of therapy? Who's a candidate? Well, any man or woman who has complaints of fatigue, whether it be just exhaustion or more fatigue than what they're used to, difficulty losing weight, specifically midline weight, that seems to increase and get more difficult to lose as we age. People that have decreased motivation, mental focus. Is there a certain age that these things start to happen? Um, do you find? I generally start treating people in their mid to late 30s. That's generally when testosterone oh, starts wow. to become depleted. That's earlier than I thought. It is earlier than a lot of people think. Yeah. Um, we know that probably at least five years before a woman has her first hot flash, she's already been depleted of testosterone. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, that is really good to know. Now, let's talk about the benefits of hormone replacement therapy, short and long sure. term. Mm -hmm. Well, you, hormones are touted as the feel-good uh, therapy of this day and age, but really, in addition to the short-term benefits, like reducing hot flashes and night sweats and helping women sleep better, um, helping prevent against vaginal dryness and incontinence, helping with energy and mood, there's a lot of long-term benefits to hormones, and those include cognition and prevention of Alzheimer's, um, Testosterone can lower blood sugars and lower blood pressure. It can improve and decrease risk of insulin sensitivity and diabetes. So a lot of short-term and long-term health reasons to have your hormones restored to optimal levels. Now, how do we, or how do you suggest someone who's at home and then we're like, mm, maybe this does affect me. Uh, how do they get evaluated and see if maybe they're a candidate for it? Sure. If you're having any of the symptoms that I had gone over or think your hormones are imbalanced, then basically just call the office and schedule an appointment. I usually will start off having a conversation with my patients. Uh, uh, figuring out what's going on in their lives and what their complaints are and I'll order lab work accordingly and then usually I'll sit down with them about a week to 10 days later and go over the lab work point by point and show them what I feel is suboptimal or deficient and what we can do to fix it and how I expect them to feel once it is fixed. Now tell me about mom doc and what makes you guys different. Um, <laughs> Even though the, mo the name suggests um, females only, we do treat females and men for hormone issues. Um, the unique thing about our company specifically is that we do obstetrics and gynecology primarily and it's all women physicians treating women and I think that goes a long way in women's health care. Yeah, absolutely. And you have a special too for anyone watching today. We do have a special, $200 off any package of five pellet insertions and we have an ongoing special that it isn't limited to today um, any military police or fire service members get 10 percent discounts on any cash pay procedures all right and you can learn more everyone or make an appointment to get that special by going to momdocwomenforwomen.com or by calling the number on your screen either number and by the way they have um, several locations more than 20 across the valley so i'm sure there's going to be one near you